So in this video, we're going to be talking about the moon in Aquarius in the ninth house. The moon shows us the, the uh, source of comfort, um, our emotional comfort zone, our source of security and stability. Um, and in another sense as well, it shows us the resources that we like to use in order to create or in order to do things. So resources doesn't literally have to be physical. It can be mental resources. Um, just like, you know, people can have high mental facu faculties. That's a figure of speech for saying that they have the talent or the what it takes um, in order to do something. So resources can be a certain trait or a certain talent as well. And that's what the moon can show us. Um, it's something that we have access to. And when it's in the sign of Aquarius, the form of security that these people uh, rely on is emotional detachment. They have a need for emotional detachment because the moon shows us our needs. In Aquarius, which is the sign of fixed air, meaning a constant state of change or a constant state of movement um, or, or communication and mutability. Um, this indicates that the moon's roots are ungrounded. And so it really doesn't feel too comfortable in Aquarius, especially because Aquarius is the eighth sign from the sign that the moon rules, which is Cancer. Um, and why that's important is because uh, the, there's an energy of eighth um, in, in this placement of moon in Aquarius. And eighth is where the moon is debilitated. It really doesn't feel fulfilled on an emotional level, but on a material level, it tends to do okay. But I covered what that um, that meaning is and all that stuff more deeply in my Moon in Aquarius video or in the 11th house video. Um, but anyways, uh, the Moon in this case for you is in the 9th house as well. The 9th house is the house of beliefs, um, philosophy, education, learning, um, convictions. And it's, it's the house of like knowledge, things that came from the minds of other people, especially ones that we um, perceive as above us or as more qualified as ourselves um, than ourselves. So when the moon is in the ninth house and in Aquarius, the resource that you utilize in order to live life or to do things in general is you use um, your logical convictions as a basis for um, how you approach life. So a lot of times these people that have this placement use science as a resource and they use specifically knowledge of science. Like they'll use um, textbook knowledge. They'll use things that are written or that are credible and very detailed forms of science because moon and sagittarius have this energy of of like needing a lot of evidence or like things for for things to be very realistic so generally speaking this is the comfort zone of somebody that has the moon in the ninth house they uh they rely on their logical convictions and they almost have like this faith or this belief in science and this is where they always return to because the moon shows us kind of like our emotional home as well as our physical home but you know the home is just some place that we return and in this case on an emotional level these people always fall back or feel most secure and emotionally um, balanced when they are relying on science and knowledge and um, especially very realistic forms of beliefs. Now, the, the, the other thing is there's an emotional detachment from Moon and Aquarius and this is uh, because in order to feel secure, they need to detach the emotionally from things because too much emotions or too much intuition 
can make them feel uncomfortable or ungrounded. They like things to be very uh, calculated and stuff um, when they have this placement of ninth house and in Aquarius. And too much emotions or too much uh, feeling or too much intuition they feel can um, offset the truth. Or they feel like it will mislead them. There we go. That's the that's a good way to put it. They feel like too much emotionality will mislead them. And so it will disrupt their understanding of reality. It will under it will disrupt their sense of security and their beliefs. They're very attached in to their convictions. So that pretty much sums up this placement. Hopefully that was insightful or interesting in some way. Um let's see. Yeah, generally speaking, they just want to, uh, these people want to detach from emotional bias. Um, but uh, other than that, if you enjoyed, uh, please uh, consider leaving a like, sharing this video with somebody you know that may have this placement. Or, um, of course, subscribing if you would like to see more videos from this channel or more content in general, because I know I do... Um, audio format a lot it's more so um, audio and stuff um, in addition i do natal chart readings and, and inquiries the link is in the description for that if you are interested um, and other than that i will see you guys in another video